you have to cite your sources for all academic papers. And on your Political Science 230 Library Research Guide down at the bottom, I included information on citing MLA or APA style. Just be sure to use the same format for the entire paper. So if you chose MLA, you go to a separate research guide that uh, gives you some hints on formatting your paper. There's citing sources over here on the left. Very handy uh, site to use is called Night Cite, and it's created by Calvin College. It will help you cite both an MLA and APA format. Just be sure in the left-hand column, you choose the format you would like to use. Then you choose what type of information it is. Uh, let's say you had a website, you click on website, fill in the, all the information you have, click submit, and it generates the citation for you. As you saw, most of our databases in OneSearch will show you how to cite both an MLA and APA format. But it, when you're using those reliable websites, you're going to have to cite your information yourself, create your own citation. How to format your paper. We often find students, you know, want to know how to format their actual paper. And we have two videos here. They're put on by, we did not create them. So one is from Columbus State University on how to format an MLA paper in Word. And the other is how to format in Google Docs. If you chose APA citation style, we have a similar guide with some websites, uh, including down at the bottom, here's that night site for citing your paper. There's YouTube videos, again, on how to format your paper APA style. APA itself gave this quick reference guide, which I find very handy for a journal article or a book or a chapter in an edited book. And you can save this as a PDF just by clicking on that link. It will show you um, how to save that document so you could have it on hand yourself. You can always come see us if you need help. Um, and I recommend to students just gather your thoughts when you find a doc, a paper or a information that you might want to use, even if you're not sure whether you're going to use it or not, gather the information you need, like the author, title of the article, website title, or the title of the book, journal title, and how to get back to that item. And then um, you, if you need help, at least we have some of the information there and we can get back to it. And you can always see us or contact us in any way. Remember, we have a 24-7 chat service and they can help you with citing your sources, even if it's on a Sunday afternoon in the library here at SC4 is not open. Thank you.